Hi everyone, it's Ruby and Rayleigh and welcome back to our channel. Today we're doing the Twin Telepathy 3 Colour Paint Phone Case Art Challenge. So this video has been highly requested by you all and we've really wanted to do it for a long time now. Our mum has ordered loads of phone cases and we have no idea what they are. As always, we want to make sure all of you are staying safe. For the UK, lockdown is starting to be relaxed. But please make sure whenever you go outside that you do social distance and follow the government's rules. And thank you so much for all of your support and lovely comments on the community page. And for everyone who's still working hard to keep us all safe. Okay, so let's get started. So we've got our twin telepathy board up and if you haven't seen one of these challenges before, we'll have two different rounds. So all together we will be painting four phone cases. And for each round, our mum will give us a variety of different decorations and colours of paints and we have to try and pick the same one as the other person. If we do, we get a point. If we don't, we get no points. On to round one. Three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa, these are really nice. They're so cute. Phone cases from KW Mobile and we have a pink one and a white one. Our mum says she got these from Amazon and they were $5.99 each. So we'll put the links in the description and take the white one out. I think this could go either way for both of us. But automatically, wow that's a big word, I go over to this because of many reasons. But the main one which I can say which won't give it away is because of like the way it is you know this one is a cute case too but i feel like this one is better for the sort of you know i'm gonna pick this one well you've officially confused me i think she's talking about this one just the way she kind of described it reminds me of the way she described this tone so this is mine and this is mine <laughs> round two Two, one. <gasps> oh, cute! These are cute colours. We haven't used these paints for a while, so I've actually forgot what they're like. I remember them being very watery. But yeah, they're really watery, but they're so good. They're like mm -hmm. acrylic and nice. I think this is my favourite out of the two. Depending on what we picked, one will go better with the other, and it relies a lot on phone cases. You know what? That colour looks really nice with that as well. I really think that. Um, Ravy will pick this one because I feel like we got the same thing as the last time because you kind of named everything that I was thinking. So I'm going to pick this one. I know you're not talking about the one I want to pick. I really hope this is right. I'm going to be so sad if this is wrong. But I'm going to pick this one. So I'm picking this one and I'm picking this one. On to round three. Second one. Three, two, one. Ooh, cute. Okay. Should we have yeah. metallic silver and metallic like copper colour? The copper's actually really pretty as well. So it's the silver. I want this one for a few reasons. One, it goes better with the colour I picked in my opinion. Two, I think it's safest. I don't know if I can say that. Three, I prefer it. I think Ruby prefers it. So I'm picking this one. So I think everything you just said matches up to, in my opinion, this one. So I'm going to pick this one. I'm picking this one. Round four. Three, two, one. <gasps> Aww. These are like neon colours. We have yellow and orange. And they're very oh. bright. <laughs> yeah, they are. This one's kind of... Um, the yellow's kind of grainy as well. Yeah, the yellow's kind of pastel. You don't want it to look bad now because you have two colours which might not like go with some of them. So yeah. automatically this one obviously not goes with it. So, don't budge the table. I need to start by seeing what looks best. You know, I think they both look good and it depends how you do it. I know she loves this colour and that might be a giveaway but that's a fact and Ruby already knows that. But I like this colour more than this colour. So we've got a bit of a we've got a bit <laughs> of a tie here. So it looks like I'm gonna compromise and I'm gonna pick this one. Thank you. I'm gonna pick this one. On to the final round before we start painting the first face. Three, two, one. Ooh, okay. okay. These are like cards. 
We have graphics, and then we have oh, cartoon and doodle. doodle. Wow, these are cool, and they're like a sort of things you would put on like a phone case. So, cartoon could mean like cartoon characters. You know, you can have Kermit and the Frog on there, which would actually look pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. <gasps> doodle, I guess that could just be anything. It could be like squiggles, more inspirational, yeah. And graphics could mean like lips on there, you know, anything like that. I have such a good idea for this one. I've seen it on my phone case before. I don't know what you're gonna pick. Um, I have an idea that I could do for this one. I'm not sure if it would it work. I yeah, have an like... idea for this one. I don't think any of us are gonna do this one. I just feel like it's not, out of all of these, you wouldn't pick this one. And then between these two, I feel like you're gonna pick this one more likely. This one seems quite hard to do. I think this one's more complicated than this one. So I'm just gonna assume she's talking about this one. And I wanna do this one anyway, so that's fine by me. <laughs> so I'm picking this one. And I'm picking this one. Okay, so we've got all of our stuff now. We've got the water, we've got the paintbrushes, we've also got some masking tape for our designs. Our mum has also given us a black and white Fosca pen for the finishing touches at the end, and something to stencil it out with like a pen. A lot of you have been asking what paints and pens we use and other materials in our video, so we'll link all of them in the description if you want to do this yourself. Okay, so we've got all our materials, but although we know what theme we've both chosen, we don't actually know what we're going to do. So we've both got phones, and we're going to do some research on ideas. And I yeah. just actually got an idea from my lock screen. Okay, so we've both done some research, and this is the image I've chosen. And this is the image I've chosen, something like this. Are you gonna outline yours first, or does it not need outlining? It needs drawing out. <laughs> so the first thing we're gonna do is sketch out our designs. Is yours really complicated? Mm, mediocre. I'm going to try drawing it with a pencil because the pen's a bit thick. I'm using a pencil too now because it was just too thick and it kind of just kept, it didn't really help. Okay, so this is what my design currently looks like and pencil was actually so much better than pen to use because yeah. you can rub it out and it's just easier to draw with. Yeah, and this is mine and I really love it. I just think it's adorable. I can't wait to start painting it but I'm probably going to have to be so precise because the thing I've drawn is quite small. Okay, so now we're just going to go straight into the painting. I'm going to start with this colour. I'm going to start with two colours mixed. I needed a base coat. Acrylics dry very quick, but to speed it up, you can use a hairdryer. That's a very good. Remember when we found out that you could use a hairdryer, we were like, we've been waiting a day for yeah. this, and we could have realized this ages ago. We were excited. And now I'm gonna start the third. Mine right now looks actually quite good, but I feel like it's like it kind of looks a bit messy right now. So when I add the pens, I feel like it's gonna like make it the thing I picked. Sounds good. I'm still using my second colour next, but I'm using it, so I've mixed a lot of colours and I'm using it without mixing. Okay, so we've both just finished our paint. We might need a bit more touching up at the end, but for the most part, it's done now. And the next thing will be our pens, which are the finishing touches. And now we're going to be using black and white markers to finish it off and make the final details. Okay. 
Okay, so we've both finished our painting phone cases all together now. I am so happy with mine. The pen at the end definitely brought it all together. Same, I love it and I just can't wait to use it on my phone. Now we're gonna reveal it to each other and to all of you. Okay, we're gonna take this border down. Hello. Hello. <sighs> yeah, I'm showing mine first. Have you gone then? Three, two, one. <gasps> It looks exactly like it. <gasps> Thank you. <gasps> that looks... Whoa. That's like, like, there's no... I'm so proud of it. It's perfect, literally. <laughs> it's like nothing The better. colours are a bit different to the other one, but I'm very proud of it. Okay, I'll show you now. It's the red head power. This is what I did. This is... Blossom, I think. I ex her hair's a bit more blonde and she's a bit just lighter in general. I'm very proud of this. I'm 100% going to put it on my phone right now. Some of me and my friends have lock screens with the power of girls. Yours right now. And this is actually what my lock screen is. I cannot wait to see yours. I'm excited. Okay, close your eyes. I think they're probably going to be completely different. Yeah, I can tell you that. Three, two, one. <gasps> That is so good. That's so cute. Wait, we did re we got the same colours and the same focus and the same pen. Oh, oh wow. But they're completely different sorts Whoa. of things. Wait, did you get what did you get? Cartoon? Y yeah. Did you? We got the same thing! Well mine's not as cartoony, but I'm probably gonna make the eyes like more cartoony after this video. Okay, wait, yeah, let me show them. That's so cute. Three, two, one. So this is what it looks like. So I did an elephant, a little bunny, and I think that's like the ground and them holding balloons. I got it off the internet and I love it. I just I think it's, they're so different. We got the same thing and look how different we interpreted it. High five, we're good. So that is our round one three color painted phone case. Oh, and I'm so cute. proud. I love this so much. Yeah, they're so, so cute. cute. I think it's gonna be so hard to beat this one, but anyway, can't wait to do another one. <laughs> Three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa! Ooh, phone cases. So we have a clear one, which I think yeah. is adorable, and a black one. I've got a good idea of what I want to do on these. I've got a good idea for this one. I think, I automatically think that both of us would go to this one. Not because okay. we pick it like favorite, but I feel like it's gonna be like better for painting. And you won't know what I mean by that, to be honest. Actually, and I feel like it's really like a cute colour yeah. and everything will like look nice with it. So I'm going to go with this one. Yeah, I think I... Yeah, she's talking about this one. I'm going to go for this. And I'm going to go for this one. Three, two, one. <gasps> metallic? So we have a pink metallic one and a bluey like purple. Okay, so... I really want to pick this colour because I have an idea of what I want to do on here and it works so well with this colour. I think I'm going to pick this one because of many reasons half of them will just give it away and also I feel like this colour is not something really would pick for many reasons which I think she knows as well. So I feel like on Ruby's behalf <laughs> I'm going to go with this one. That's confused me but I still want this one so I'm still going for it. So this is the one I'm picking and this is the one I'm picking. Colour number two. Three, two, one. <gasps> oh, these are cute colours. I actually love these colours. Okay, so we have a very bright blue, quite neon. And then we have like a beige colour. It's like sand in the sea. So I've looked at these colours together and I think these two would look really good together, but I don't think Ruby's going to pick it at all. For that reason, <laughs> I'm picking this colour. So I think you eliminated this one. And also I feel like this one will go good with that and I think you're on about like picking this one. So I'm gonna pick this one. I'm gonna pick this one. On to the final colour. Three, two, one. <gasps> Christmas, Christmas colours. <laughs> <laughs> okay, red, green, white. White? Yeah, I'm gonna go with the white. But oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, God. I think. For mine, I want to go with this one, but I have to hear what Ruby says. Okay, so I don't actually know what I want because these are quite, not like similar colours, but they're kind of this or that, you know? So I think I'm going to pick this colour because literally every reason I could have said is because I can't see them. But I think I'm going to pick this. Okay. 
I'm gonna pick this one for a few reasons. One, it goes with a design I put in mind really well. Two, it goes with the colors I've already got. And three, I feel like this could go either way anyway for both of us, so I've just kind of decided to go with what I think will go best. So I'm gonna pick this one, and I'm gonna pick this one. On to the final round before we start painting. Three, two, one. Ooh, the design. We have nature, abstract, pattern. Okay, I already know what the design I want goes under, but obviously I can change it. I don't think I'll be able to do that, and also I have an idea on this one, and I feel like this is like not something I feel like doing, and I don't think Bailey would do it either. So I'm gonna pick this one, because I feel like it's something I've been wanting to do for ages, and I've seen it on the internet loads. And I feel like it's something Bailey would do too. I think this could go any way, depending on what the colors you've got, what you wanna pick, what you think I pick, you know? So I'm completely stuck. I'm probably just gonna go with the one that fits the thing that I'd like to do anyway. So I'm gonna go with this one. And I'm gonna go with this one. And now we're gonna start painting. Okay, so we've got all of our supplies now. We've got our phone cases, we've got pencils, paint brushes, we've got our pens, and we've also got a sponge this time. And we have just looked on the internet and found the design we're gonna try and like, mm -hmm. inspiration, like, off of. This is mine. And I'm gonna do something like this, but without the like, scratchy bits. So the first thing we're going to do is sketch out with the pencil and we have definitely found pencils work better. I don't need to sketch it out. I'm going to do something else to my to prepare mine but it isn't with a pencil, it's with this. I actually don't think I'm going to need to sketch mine out so I'm just going to go for it. So I just finished my taping and I'm about to start doing the colours. Ready for my second colour now. Well, actually, I'm doing all of them. my last colour and the really? reason yeah it's because like it's quite slow when you get started oh my goodness it's been maybe like one minute I know it's, it's very boring. fast so now I've finished the painting but now I'm gonna do the fun bit which could make or break it really hope make it but yeah let's let's do that bit That worked so well, it's so good, but you've got to make sure whenever you do it, definitely make sure you do this, it's like really important. Make sure to tape the tape off if you're doing this while well, it's wet, because if you take it off when it's all dry, the paint, dry paint will come off with it. I finished all my painting now, and the only thing I've got left to do is finishing touches with the markers. Same, I've got this marker I'm gonna outline. Okay, so we're finally finished. I'm so happy with how mine looks. I'm really Same. excited to show you. I don't think I can pick between this round and last round. I don't think I actually have a favorite. What about you? Same. Anyway, we're gonna take the barricade away and then we're gonna rock, paper, scissors and see who's shown first. <coughs> Hello. Hi. Rock, paper, scissors, and <laughs> Close your eyes. Three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa, oh my good. I did like sponging method. That looks so good. That's so cute. It's simple too, which I love about it. Oh my goodness. And you could do so many more things that you could like. We did it. very good on this challenge. Really? We did very good on this challenge. Oh. So this is mine. Three, two, one. It's very simple, but I love it so much. And yeah, the method's are really easy. You can also search it up on the internet. You could also do it with like scrapes and it or add your like own personality to it. So that's mine. And now we're gonna see where it is. It's really good. And we actually did really well. Show your eyes. Three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa, that's so cute. Thank you. We did really well, didn't we? Wow, wow, that's so good. like matching. So we got everything the same apart from the style yeah i got nature i got pattern you're like really good at the arty ones i feel like you like have that artistry and like cartoons thank you okay so this is mine 
I did a butterfly and it's obviously a black background so I did a white outline and I kind of tried to make it like cartoon yeah. themed, if that makes sense. And I'm very proud of it, I love it a lot. It's so good. So this is our round two three colour painted cases. I love both of them, I feel like we like did really good. Yeah we did do really good, the only thing we actually got wrong in this entire challenge was the style in round two. Okay, so that's the end of this video. Make sure to head over to the community page and comment which one's your favourite. Rubies? Or Rayleigh's? Or I'm anything. very proud of how I've done. I'm very proud of how you've done. So that's the end of the video. We really hope you enjoyed it. We have two shout outs for this week's video. The first shout out goes to It's Jessica. Thank you so much for commenting and subscribing to us. And happy birthday for tomorrow. Second shout out goes to Heather Brown. Thank you so much for commenting a lot on the community page and being really positive in the comments. We can't end this video without thanking our notifications squad and early squad. We love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching our video. We really hope you are staying safe. We love you. Bye. Bye. Hi everyone, it's Ray. Ray. <laughs> I'm gonna pick this one. I'm gonna go to this one. Um, oops. I don't know. So what we'll do in this video is three. Yeah. <laughs>